In this demonstration, we'll show how we can apply the 3 to 5 axis conversion or automatic tool tilting function to allow us to reach deeper into cavities with shorter tools while still avoiding collisions. We have a part here with a fixed axis finishing toolpath, which will run in a simple verification mode with the automatic collision checking turned on. As we expected, we'll see that there would be a collision with the part if we use this shorter tool. We can see in the verification check that we have a collision between the holder and the part on both sides of the cavity. In this case, NX turns the toolpath red in the collision zone. So to allow us to machine this cavity with the shorter tool, and assuming we can run the job on a 5-axis machine, we can select the automatic tool tilt option. As we do that, we can set or change various clearance or maximum tilt angle parameters as needed, and then we recompute the operation. Now, as we run the verification again, uh, we can see how with this option turned on, the tool will be automatically tilted to avoid the collisions. The remaining area of the toolpath will be the same as the fixed axis method. This approach is an easy way to start applying the value of 5-axis machines in cases where you have been using fixed axis techniques.